Over 70% of solar panels come from Asia, but it doesn't mean that you have to get Chinese solar panels. America makes them just as fine, but it can be hard to figure out which panels came from the US and which didn't. Hey, I'm Jason, and in this video, we're gonna be looking at American solar brands and their best solar panels. But first, let's talk about why you would or wouldn't wanna get American solar panels. You see, their main drawback is that they cost more than Asian panels. I'll say that they're about 20% more expensive. And it's natural, since the labor in the US costs significantly more than in Asia. But now, what about the advantages? Well, the quality of American-made panels is higher on average. And American brands sometimes offer better warranties than most Chinese companies. With Asian manufacturers, a 12-year product warranty its the most common whilst US brands lean more into the 25-year warranty category. Uh, customer service is much easier to get too. Not that solar owners need it that often, and maybe there's just a certain comfort in knowing that you buy things made by your fellow countrymen. I don't know, that's just how I see it, but if there are any other reasons, please go and leave them in the comment section. We'd be really interested to read them. The hidden advantage of American-made panels is that sometimes they're easy to get. So here's an example. In spring 2022, US borders blocked the import of solar shipments from Asia because they suspected that Chinese companies evade taxes. Now, immediately, America found itself at a shortage of solar panels. Well, at A1 Solar Store, we only had American panels at that time, and they were in very high demand. The relationship between China and the US remains unstable, so similar things may happen again in the future. So the question is, which American solar panels are best? Well, first, we should define what American panels are. First, there are overseas brands that have factories in the US. Then there are American brands that have factories overseas. And finally, there are American companies that make solar panels in America. Pure American-only production is rare though. More often, it's mixed. A company has a factory in America and a few facilities somewhere else. I'll focus more on the latter type of companies, but we'll briefly go over some big names from other types as well. Now, when we talk about overseas brands that have factories in America, Q-Cells immediately comes to mind. It is an amazing South Korean brand with a great reputation, and they make some of their panels here in the US as well. Panasonic shared a facility in Buffalo with Tesla, but gave it up in 2020, and now it fully outsources manufacturing of solar panels. German company SolarWorld has a factory in Oregon. Hmm. But now what about American brands that make panels somewhere else? Well, the most obvious example is SunPower, an American company founded by Stanford's former engineering professor, Richard Swanson. SunPower is famous for solar panels that break all efficiency records, getting the best reviews from pretty much everyone, and they cost a fortune to install. SunPower used to make solar panels in the US, but, well, they don't anymore. The company spun off manufacturing into a separate company called Maxian, with factories in Singapore. Tesla claims to make their panels in the US, but the news says that they have factories in China as well, or simply buy panels from Chinese brands. A fresh brand, Aptos Solar from California, has its panels made in China, Indonesia, and Australia. Finally, let's move on to American-made panels made by American brands or at least North American. And I say this because there is Silfab, a strong Canadian brand with factories in Washington and Toronto, Canada. First Solar has three factories in Ohio and wants to build its fourth factory in the Southeast. Now this company also makes panels in Malaysia. Their product is quite specific though. Thin film panels for utility scale projects. So I'm not gonna to focus too much on them. Now California brand Solaria has a very fun very well-designed panels for home, and some of them are made in the US and some in South Korea. Finally, there is Mission Solar for true purists. The brand is from Texas, and it makes solar panels in San Antonio. So let's go over the five best panels that are made in America. For starters, I'd like to highlight Silfab Elite. Now, the company states that these panels are manufactured exclusively in the US. They are also, allegedly, the most efficient out of all American-made panels. The panels from Elite Series range from 380 to 420 watts in output, and the efficiency goes as high as 21.9%, which is indeed very high. The average number of top-tier panels is around 21%. The highest it gets is just shy of 23%. Now, overall, it's a great panel for small to large home installations, and the warranty stands out. 
The company offers a 25-year product warranty and a 30-year warranty for performance. Next up, we have Mission Solar from San Antonio. Now, their best solar panel for home is probably the MSC Perk 66. It provides up to 395 watts of power output. Now, there is nothing too special about it. It's just a good, solid, all-black panel, not too expensive and, well, not too cheap either. It's very sturdy, which is important for Texas with all of its tornadoes, and it can easily withstand the wind of up to 210 miles per hour. The next on my list is my personal favorite, Power XT panel from Solaria. It's one of the most beautiful solar panels out there. And it's very different from the others because it's not actually composed of solar cells as the others. Instead, it's made from shingles. Shingles are independent from each other, and this makes Power XT much more resistant to shading. On average, this panel would lose about 40% less energy from shading than solar panels made of solar cells. Uh, the downside, though, of Solaria panels is that they are quite expensive. Uh, let's talk about Tesla's solar panels as well. The origins are in question. Uh, Tesla has a solar factory in Buffalo, New York, but CNBC reports that the majority of their photovoltaics are made in China. Uh, essentially, they have one model that they use for all of their solar installations, if we're not talking about shingles and Tesla solar roof. The panels themselves are quite good. They have up to 430 watts of power output, with the maximum efficiency reaching 19.8%. They come with a 25-year warranty for product and performance. Now, Tesla solar panels are relatively inexpensive, but the big problem about them is the poor customer service. Mm -hmm. You might have to wait some time before the workers arrive to actually install your system. You can go check out our video about Tesla's solar venture and its importance for the industry. I'll leave a link in the description. For the last place in the list, I'm going to just cheat a little bit Shh. and name a panel from Qcells, a Korean brand. They've got a facility in Dalton, Georgia, and they claim the panels that they offer in the US are indeed made in America. The best panel for homeowners from them is Q-Peak Duo Black at G10 Plus. These panels provide up to 400 watts. They come with 25-year warranties for product and performance, and they age slower than most panels, losing only 0.5% of their output per year. Now, I would say that they have a very good design. They are sturdy and not too expensive either. And it's certainly one of the most popular panels in our store. And that's it. That is my list of top five American-made panels. If you have something that you'd like to add to this list, please let us know in the comments. Oh, and go check out our magazine, our socials, and of course, please go check out our A1 Solar Store for American-made solar panels at a good price. I'm Jason. We'll see you next time.